Hello and welcome back. Here we are in the Dark Tower. Level 74 and level 75 is what we are going to be doing today. I am really excited to find out a little bit more about Mira's story and also see how challenging level 75 is. It is increasing incredibly quickly now, so I uh, cannot wait to get started. Before we do, though, please just take a couple of seconds and make sure that you are subscribed. And uh, please go ahead and like the video so that... Uh, Number one, you're aware of when new videos are coming out. It's super helpful for me as well. So thank you very much. Let's get 74 started with our chance wheel. It's chance wheel time. And uh, we have been getting deemed a lot by this 20% uh, hearts. Looks like we're going to get a couple back, though. We're gaining 10% hearts right now, which is really helpful. These battles are getting uh, quite challenging. And, you know, my... Um, Let's start out with Supernova here. Um, my mana isn't lasting as long and my chicken reserves are kind of starting to slip. Okay, so we are, we have to remember that we're now multiplying the second row. So we have to put our zero here. And then two times two is gonna be four. And then we're gonna add down. Two plus zero is two. These don't perfectly line up. So nine plus four is 13. So we have to carry the next one into our hundreds place. And so, 6 plus 1 plus 1, that is going to be 8. 832 is going to be our answer. And we are making our way through our fifth grade curriculum right here, so um, having a blast with it. <coughs> Excuse me. That was great spell power bonus there, and it looks like one more might do us. Ion Cannon is going to hit for 1988. They've got spell power bonus as well. Uh, and we don't have enough mana, so let's switch over to our mythical attacks. And I think that we want to go ahead and do a shroom boom here. All right, so we are zero is our first value, and these are all a zero for place. Another zero, and then this is going to be a two, and that's going to be a zero, and that is how we would add that down. Woohoo! We've got it right. And let's see, Shroom Boom. All right, Cloudneak is running away. Cloud Caller is gonna jump up. Ion Cannon is coming at us. That hits, it misses. That is good that it missed. Falling Star Smash. All right, we're gonna add 19 and three, then we're gonna divide by nine. How would you write this expression? So we're gonna do 19 plus three divided by, not 19, 9. And that's how we would write out the expression. Woohoo! Okay, goodbye Cloud Caller. We are done with this, so we are going to be moving up to the next floor. 21 battle stars here, that is awesome. All right, 10 more stars. Griff Room is getting closer and closer. I really hope that we get double stars for our next level because we will be fighting three monsters as we head on up to level 75. You ready? You ready? We ready. Okay, let's go to 75. And Mira says, the wizard has not been seen since, but students from the academy still try to climb the tower. He hoped that someday a student would be strong enough to challenge him, and so he would return to accept the challenge. All right, so will we be strong enough here? We have rack a rack and let's go ahead and do a solar blast here. How would you write this expression? Subtract 4 from 16. 16 minus 4 times 3. And remember, we would do this stuff in the parentheses first. Uh, you, it's just writing it in the correct order is all we're seeing to make sure that we're thinking about the math in the correct way. Oh man, look at that. It's, uh, I, I love Dra Dragon Lee, is that right? I love that guy. That is cool. All right, Forest Hurricane hits for 2,500 points of damage. I'm gonna do one more attack. Um, and then I'll go ahead and have some chicken. All right, Ayana has a favorite video game she likes to play. She earned 16, 160 points 
she knows that she can earn 140 points per star. So excited. Uh, complete the math sentence to show how many stars Ayana collected. So okay, so we have 160 stars divided by 40 points equals four stars collected. And, oh, wait, let's see. Complete the math sentence to show how many stars Ayana collected. So 160 divided by 40 would equal four stars. So, oh, 160 points, 40 points per star. Okay, the labels were wrong. There we go, okay. And we are good now, Woohoo! Yeah, pay attention to those details and uh, you will be getting your questions right. All right, I think one more hit will do it. I don't remember this guy's name, Dragonling or something like that. He's an old prodigy and uh, he's, he's, he's the, the choice of the character that I like to start out with. Um, awesome. Okay, so we are out of energy. I think I might just go ahead and build up a little bit. So I'm not gonna really show how to multiply this out. I am just gonna go ahead and take out my calculator. Um, follow your parents or your teacher's rules as far as that. Um, practicing every once in a while so you remember the mechanics of uh, how to multiply larger numbers is great. All right, goodbye, rack -a rack And here we go, draggling, draggling. Okay, 44, 15 points of damage, and my monsters are gone. I don't know if I can get, I don't know if I can get more pets, or if it's just me by my lonesome now. I'm going to continue to use Falling Star Smash just to build up my mana a little bit. The teacher has 200 crayons in the classroom. They divide them evenly between eight cups and put two cups on each table. How many crayons are there at each table? Okay, so they're div divided... They, the teacher has 200 crayons. They divide them evenly between eight cups and put two cups on each table. Okay, so each table is going to have um, two cups. So it would be four. Okay, so four tables. There would be four tables. And so uh, let's go ahead and start off 200 divided by 20, by, <laughs> divided by two. Sorry, my mind. Whew. That's going to be 100. So there would be 100 um, uh, crayons, then divided by 8. That should be 1. Let me go ahead and think about this one. Okay, so the teacher has 200 crayons in the classroom. They're, they are being put into 18 cups. So 8 divided by 200. Let's start out there. 8 divided by 200. Does that go in evenly? So this is going to be 2, which would be 16. So that would be 15 crayons per cup. And then 2 cups per table, Would we, we would multiply that now. So that would be 30. So there would be 30 at each table. Okay. Nope. No. 8 times... Okay, so we have 8 cups. Oh, that's 20. 25, so there would be 50. Okay. Oh my goodness! Sometimes that happens. That's okay. Um, I needed. I should have uh, thought my way through the problem a little bit clearer, and that is a okay. All right. So we missed there, and let's go. That'll give us a chance to build up a little bit more mana. Okay. So uh, Anna Palm has nine pieces of gum in their pocket that each weighs 5,400 milligrams. They put another 2,378 milligrams of gum in their pocket. What is the amount? Uh, total weight of the gum in Anna, Anna Palm's pocket now. So each of the gum weighs 5,400 milligrams, and then they put another this amount of gum in their pocket. So 9 times 5,400 is our first step. And so that is going to mean we have 48,600. Let me write that out. 48,600. Okay, and then we add two, three, seven, eight to that. All right, so we're going to regroup this here. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a 10. 
So it would be 50,978. 50,978 would be our answer. Woohoo! Awesome. So these word problems, I'm going to have to kind of slow down a little bit in order to showcase them. And we get stuff wrong. It's okay. Goodbye, Dragling. Makes me want to play Old Prodigy. Solarix is hitting us with Ion Cannon 3623. So I'm definitely going to get some chicken in right now. Take a little chicken break here. 24 chickens left. Let's see if we... 24 rotisserie chickens left. Falling Star Smash. Let's see if that is enough to go ahead and get us through this dark tower. The height of a plant was 340 centimeters. After one week, it grew by 160 centimeters. And after three more weeks, the new height was 550 centimeters. How much did the plant grow in three weeks? Okay, so the new height was 550 centimeters. Um, and it grew 160 in the first week. So 160 plus 340 is going to be 500. And so after one week, it grew 160 centimeters. So 500 after the first week. After three more weeks, the new height was 550. So 550 minus 50 minus 500 would equal to 50. Awesome, awesome. And there we go. Okay, goodbye, Solarix. Level 95. That explains why uh, it, this battle took a while. So yeah, they are jumping up super fast. I wonder if we're going to see monsters above level 100. 32 battle stars there. 15 more. Let's open up this chest. We got a morph marble for Miss Steel. All right. And let's see if Mira gives us a reward. The next challenge awaits. Okay, you so, ready? So we did not get an award, a reward for that level. Let's share our that. We're going to start out with level 76 in our next video. We'll be doing 76 to 78. And uh, the challenges will increase as will our uh, math increase as well. I think we might be entering 6th grade math prior to getting out of the Dark Tower. So uh, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. I will be uh, very excited to see you guys back here next time. Take care. Keep on prodiging on. Bye-bye.